Hey guys, I'm Ellie. Some of you may know me as Ella underscore fit from Instagram, but my protein have asked me to rate my fridge this morning. So I'm gonna give you a quick sneak peek of what's in my fridge. Okay, so I actually went food shopping yesterday, so I've got all fresh ingredients for the week. I normally go shopping on a Monday and get food probably to last me till Thursday, Friday, and then I'll go again for the weekend. Now, starting from the top shelf, I like to keep things like fresh berries. So I've got some raspberries and grapes this week. I love adding them to like my porridge and also to make yogurt bowls in the evening. And obviously it's so important to make sure that you do get those micronutrients in. I have also got these, which I put under my eyes. They're like little eye masks that I wear every morning. They really help if you have like dark puffy eyes in the morning. But yeah, they're my favorite. Obviously not a food item. Then on the second shelf, I have some ready prep meals that a company actually sent me as a meal prep to try this week. So I'm super excited to try that. I do actually try to make all of my meals, but obviously, um, you know, meal preps are super, super handy when it comes to eating on the go and when you also don't have that much time, especially during the week. Over here, we have some Nando sauces. So these are my favorite. This is Perrinets. Um, whenever we get like Deliveroo or anything, I always save the sauces. And then over here, we have some cottage cheese because I have planned to make a really delicious recipe this week which uses this cottage cheese. Moving down to the second shelf. Now this is definitely the cheese shelf. So on this shelf we have every single cheese you could possibly want. First of all I've got some reduced fat mature cheese. I always go for mature because it tastes the best. Some parmesan, low fat mozzarella and also some Reduced fat halloumi, definitely my favorite cheese. I love a bit of halloumi. And then we have some butter. Obviously every fridge has to have some butter. Moving over to this side, we have some Borsan cheese and then just some dips. So we've got some tzatziki and hummus and then also some 0% fat yogurt at the back as well. On this third shelf, we have my favorite coconut milk, which I also like to add to smoothies usually. I don't actually like to add coconut milk to coffee because I don't think it tastes that good. I've got some water. I always like to keep this in the fridge because I always try to aim for around two to three liters a day. So important to get your water in. Spring onions and lettuce. I'm definitely going through like a salad phase at the moment. I feel like I switch between vegetables and salad, but at the moment it's definitely salad. On this bottom shelf, now this is where the meat is stored. So at the moment I've got some fresh salmon fillets absolutely love these. I love like roasting them in the oven. Lean steak mints and then some bacon medallions because I prefer to have bacon medallions over normal bacon. It's obviously a lot leaner and it's super high in protein and filling. Also got some chicken breasts as well here. And then at the side, I've got some juice shots, which I've really been loving at the moment. I love just waking up in the morning, having a quick juice shot, especially like ginger and turmeric ones. Moving to the drawers. Now, the drawers, probably the most boring um, in every fridge. Now, in my fridge, I've just got lots of veggies. So I tend to have vegetables with every single meal. I've got tomatoes, more tomatoes. Oh, another kind of tomato. I've also got parsnips, carrots, peppers, onions. And then in this side, I've got broccoli, lemons and some more lettuce. That is the main side of my fridge. And now we're gonna to move to the door. We have dark chocolate because this goes in everything that I bake. I swear I'm addicted to dark chocolate. And then on this side, we've got my favorite no added sugar strawberry jam. I absolutely love this. Go through probably a jar of this a month. Moving down to the last shelf, we've got milk. I tend to stick with skimmed milk. My protein vegan protein shakes, I love these. These are so good if you just want a protein boost on the go. Um, you can also add these to like oats if you're cooking them on the hob and make them like chocolate oats. Very good. And then we've got light mayo, ketchup, of course, I'm a ketchup gal. Um, ketchup over mayo any day. And then my favorite barista oat milk, I have this in my coffee, it is the best. I would never, ever, ever have any other type of milk in my coffee. Moving up to the top shelf. Now, this is 
where the goodies are kept. So, my favorite protein bars at the moment are, oh, they're not there actually. Ah, oh, no, they're here. So my favorite protein bars at the moment are the My Protein Car Crushers in cookies and cream. I am actually obsessed with these. I have them every single day. It tastes like a chocolate bar and they're such a good alternative if you do like a chocolate sort of fix during the day. Also, other favorite treat are these protein peanut butter cups. Now these are so yummy. They taste just like a Reese cup, but obviously they're a little bit more calorie friendly. I think they're around 100 or so calories per cup, so they're super worth it if you have a sweet treat like mine. Moving over to my other jar, I have the best snack for my protein, which are these protein chopped crispies. These are honestly so delicious. They're like little clusters of chocolate granola kind of thing. So yummy. You get like four in a pot and it's definitely, definitely worth getting these. I like to also add these onto like yogurt bowls um, and just take a nice like yogurt tea granola kind of thing. And then moving back to the top shelf quickly, we have my vegan, so these are vegan carb crushers, which are also really delicious. Um, I like to go with chopped peanut flavor. And then the My Protein Vegan Baked Cookies. Oh my God. If you haven't ever put these in the microwave before, you need to try them in the microwave. Microwave them for like a minute and then top them with some ice cream and it's the best dessert ever. And then last but not least, we have my gluten-free rolled oats, which I use in my porridge every single day. They're the best ones, they come in this massive bag, so they're super good at value for money. But yeah, that's everything that's in my fridge. I hope you guys enjoyed seeing what I have pretty much on a daily basis. Make sure that you give my fridge a rating. Thanks so much for watching, guys. Be sure to like this video and subscribe to my Proteins YouTube channel, and I'll see you again soon. Bye-bye.